YouTube, this is Aztec and today I'm bringing you another installation video. This one isn't a mod, it's actually a HD texture pack. Um, some of you might already know how to install this, but those of you who don't, this video will come in handy. Um, and basically, if you don't know what a HD texture pack is, basically a standard texture pack just changes the look of Minecraft. And a HD one's obviously in HD and it just makes Minecraft look so much better. Um, you'll see in a second the comparison. Um, actually just load up Minecraft and just show what it looks like now um, but yeah the HD texture pack might lag a little bit because obviously it's a lot better graphics um, but if you've got a good computer or you set it on render distance medium or is it normal? normal um, it should work fine and yeah if you look at this as a standard Minecraft you know everybody has this to start off with um, then we'll just stand here looking at the ocean then we'll show what it looks like once I've installed the texture pack um, so, but to start off, you need to get a new um, Minecraft folder. Just go to Finder, Library, Application Support, Minecraft. Then back up your saves, put them on your desktop or something, and then delete the Minecraft folder. Um, if you've got something like Mo Creatures or Single Player Commands installed or any other mod, and then you try and texture pack it, it won't work, it'll crash. So you need to install the mods after you've installed the texture pack, and it does work because I've been doing it with Mo Creatures ever since I first installed my texture pack. Um, Okay, so yeah, to start off with, go to the text pack, MC patcher, load that up. And then it should come up with this. Um, if there's any problems open in this, just tell me and I'll try and fix it for you. But yeah, then you go on, click text pack there, browse, um, go on the HD text pack. It should be on your desktop and that should already be on places on desktop. So you go there. Minecraft for Kids, open that up, and then there'll be a zip there, Minecraft for Kids dot zip. Um, you can use any texture pack, but you need to zip it. If you don't know how you zip it, you just click on that and go on compress. So basically, if I went on that, and that was actually had all the files, and just go on compress, then put the zip in. Um, but I've already made the zip for you. So then you go on HD texture pack, Minecraft for Kids, click on the zip there, open. And you can tell it's loaded because the tile size has changed. Then you click all these, if you get rid of these and it makes Minecraft, you know, like animated lava, basically the lava actually moves. Like you can actually see it like moving around instead of just being static like on normal Minecraft. Um, and then you can tell it's loaded because it'll have the tile change there. Then just click on patch. It'll say that if you've got animations it might lag a little bit. That's basically what it says there. Then it'll come down with all these command lines and it'll... And then, then it'll just work it out. I don't know what the hell it's doing, but yeah. <laughs> then you then it says success probably, which implies that it's done. Then you click out of that. Then you go into Minecraft. Um, and one thing it does take, I thought I had a black screen first time I did it, but it does take a while to load. Um, so if you watch here, instead of loading straight away, it'll come up with a black screen like that. Then it'll go to that. And then the Mojang will stay there for longer because it has to render all the HD graphics out. So if you think it's black screened, it hasn't, it just takes longer to load because it's HD. And you can tell if it's worked because you'll have a different background here and you'll have a green creeper there. Um, so I'll just load up the test world as before and show you the difference in the graphics which is huge. Like if you look at this, you actually look at the pixels there, you can actually see like, you know, just actually little pixels in it. You know, the water looks a lot better. Basically, you delete a block like that. Yeah, that just looks so much better. Um, in fact, I think I've got time. I'll show you another texture pack um, quickly. Um, this is personally my favourite one. So I just got to delete this. Delete that. Get my new. I've already got a clean beat. I've already got a clean Minecraft folder, so I just put that in there. Um, load up that, load up the patcher, and basically that's how I install it. All you do is just get a zip of the HD texture pack, load up um, patcher, that will come up with this. Then I will just make a let's have a look what texture pack I can use. Um, what's a nice one? Um, Mesa HD, that's a nice one. So basically, I've already made a zip for that there. So basically, just click on that, compress it, you'll get a zip like that. So then I'll just show you what this one looks like. This is probably my favourite one. Um, Minecraft stuff. Texture packs. Mesa HD there. 
and then it changed so that isn't quite as good as the kids one but it's still pretty good and it's got custom lava and everything so yeah then you just click patch again then I'll say I might lag then is it done yes it's done then close it down load up Minecraft and actually one thing I want to show you before is that when you go into the library now and when you go to your jar um, there'll be a Minecraft 1.4 jar. You still just do the same with that jar there. Like you just compress that and install the mods normally. You leave that 1.1 there. You don't have to do anything to that. But you just open up the Minecraft jar there where you open with archive utility like normal. Then I'll show you this one. Um, and basically you cannot mix and match um, texture packs. If I've got a 64 by 64. I couldn't mix that with a kids one because it just crashed. Um, and I've got one called LB Photo Realism, and that's 256 pixels, which is I think it's probably 18 times better graphics than the original Minecraft. But that lags like hell for me, so I'm not gonna try and do it. Um, and yeah, one of the good things about this is if you look carefully at the water, you can actually see it shimmering, which I think is amazing because Minecraft doesn't do that. And this this text pack just makes Minecraft look so much better. Um, See, there's a sheep over there. Like when you jump in water, like everything seems so much better. The graphics is just amazing. I don't know. I don't know how I can play Minecraft without these. And it's every single block in the game, including the new wolves. Um, I can't show you a wolf at the moment. Well, if I find one, I can. But yeah, basically, just look at the sheep. See if I can get some over. So there's a black sheep there. You know, <laughs> it's kind of a weird face on it, but yeah, it just it just looks. Just the animations of everything just looks better. Um, see if I can find some more. I might be able to find a wolf actually at the end of this is a forest. Um, I want to count on the wolves that's been away. And chickens. Chickens look more realistic, that's nice. Um, don't know if I'm going to find a wolf actually because they are quite rare. And yeah, um, if you're looking for more videos on how to install Minecraft stuff, um, I don't know if I'll do a Let's Play, I might do, um, but I'm particularly good at like installing mods and whatnot, so I think I might do that. Um, like I can see the leaves look better. You know, it, it, it's just amazing how someone's actually spent the time to actually make Minecraft look this good. Um, and I'm sure, I'm sure Nosh will add modding support soon, so basically you can install these without the patcher. Um, there's some pigs. Uh, still no wolves. Uh, I was hoping to find one of them because they look they look quite good with the HD texture back on, but can't always find one, can you? I'll just show you the pigs quick. Uh, there's some cows, but well. there's pigs gone. And there's one from over here. Oh, it's lagging a bit there. No. Um, yeah, a frame it like is is normal, um, and that pig is quite weird actually. Um, still a bit of frame rate issues, but yeah, it's, I've just made a new world. But once the world fully renders, and it should be fine. See, so it's still rendering over there. Um, yeah, and I hope you've enjoyed this mod. Um, well, it isn't really a mod; it's a texture pack. But um, if you subscribe to me, I'll make lots more videos on how to install them. Um, also, if you give me a, a request for a video. Then I'll do it provided, you know, like I actually get some recognition for it. Because I'm not, yeah, I'm not, I'm not going to make a mod for everyone that asks, but if it gets requested enough, I'll definitely make one for it. Um, so yeah, um, I hope you enjoy the HD graphics. Um, have fun. Bye. It may not mean